Corporal St. John, is it? Yes, sir. Come in. Just enjoying a cup of tea, herbal, courtesy of uh, Lieutenant Whitaker. Would you like to try some? It's very good for the digestion. Uh, no, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm, I was just looking for the duty roster. I have an assignment for you. Men, Corporal. Not that they deserve to be called that. They've taken one of ours. Lieutenant Justine Norwood, a fine officer. And they have her, so, uh, yes, I will get her back, sir. With the help of men like you, we're going to take back this world. Dismissed. St. John, Court Burrell, St. John. <laughs> you got your ears on, man? Hey, is this, is this thing gonna work? Yeah, your radio works. What's up? Dig it, St. John. Hey, uh, I mean, you know, nothing. It's just, <laughs> just checking in on you. I haven't seen you since the whole swearing in thing. That was some shit about it. Right? <laughs> Taylor, you know, I'm kind of busy. Well, hey, hey, what, what the, what the hell you, you got? They got you doing? I'm, I'm in the damn infantry or some shit. Spend all day burning out nests, chopping down trees, hauling wood. So, sorry, sorry. What, are, what are you doing? Research. They got me going out into the shit, finding supplies for the officers, working on. Oh shit! Oh, I heard about that. Yeah, yeah, working on, uh, on uh, bio weapons, uh, chemical weapons, shit like that. Burn them, freaks the ground. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. Well. Taylor, I gotta go. All right, all right, hey, um, hey, look, man, it's, uh, it's just, I'm, I'm, I'm having second thoughts about all this military shit, you know. Oh, Taylor, what radio are you on? Are you sh not being monitored? Oh, shit. Huh, that's what I thought. Gotta go. St. John out. Colonel, Corporal St. John reporting in, and I'm at the last location where Lieutenant Norwood was seen. Uh, he seems pretty fortified, sir. Are you, are you sure you want me to tackle this alone? Just oh, hey. follow orders, Corporal. Garrett out. Yes, sir. Fucking A.
Okay, hang on. I'm coming. What are you doing, Lieutenant? St. Sean. Thank God I'd given up hope. Oh, yeah? Well, a good friend of mine once told me, never give up hope, because you lose that, you may as well just pack it in. Keep that in mind next time I'm ambushed by a dozen squatters. Yeah, okay, all right, listen. Camp's clear and your bike's still in one piece, so can you just get back alone, huh? Yeah, I can handle it. Thank you, St. John. Sure, now get going. Go. Deacon St. John. <laughs> hey, you got your ears on, man? Hey. Taylor, what do you need? There you are. Okay. Uh, so I finally figured out how to use this damn thing. All right. I got a secure channel and everything. So how's it going, man? <sighs> Taylor, I'm kind of busy right now, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sorry, man. Sorry. <laughs> uh, hey, so... Words out in the camp that trucks are making their way in, right under the colonel's nose. <laughs> it's good stuff, too. But do you know anything about that? I don't do drugs, too. No, I don't know anything about it. Why? No, 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 I don't, I don't either. I'm just, I saw this guy, you know, one of the new recruits, acting all suspicious. He writes in and out of camp all the time, and so I thought, I thought I'd follow him, right? <laughs> Let's see what the hell he's about. Ah, oh, God damn it, Taylor, listen to me. You just go to Corey, let him handle it. Got that? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a good call. Yeah. Okay, Mr. <laughs> St. John, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later, man. Yeah, uh, out. <laughs> Jesus Christ, tell me that. Corporal, good. I have a job that requires your unique skills. Oh, uh, sure, yeah, uh, yes, sir. You remember Vasquez? The man that went AWOL. Yeah, we tracked him to the logging camp, I remember. Well, this man, Sergeant Lee Anderson, was his partner. He was about to be arrested when he killed a guard and took off. Oh, your men have quite the code of honor. Our men? You're one of us now, remember? I've marked the location on where he was last seen on your map. Apparently, like Vasquez. He wasn't alone. Great. Why are you not working hard? Why are you still in my obstacle course? Why are you not finished with my obstacle course? Do you like it?
lost out. Captain, I found your man, Anderson, and you were right. He still had his militia insignia. He's dead? Well, let's just say that he had a run-in with a pack of wolves long before I got to him. That's a fitting end for a murderer and a thief. Yes, sir. Thank you, Corporal. Dismissed. St. John! <laughs> uh, Wade Taylor to Deacon St. John. <clears throat> Taylor, uh, I hear a bike. Tell me you're not out in the shit tracking down that drug trafficker. Okay, okay. <laughs> I won't tell you that, but I am. <laughs> God damn it, Taylor, you're gonna get yourself killed. No, man, no, no. Hey, I followed a bunch of them up the highway. Highway 97? Hey, hey, it was, no, it was, it was daylight, the weather was clear, I didn't see a single freak. Um, but there was this, this group of, of men ended up at the ski lodge. Did you even know there was a ski lodge out here? I didn't know that. Taylor. It's a sweet ass setup too. If I ever decide to bug out, that is where I'm going. <laughs> oh, shit, I gotta run. They're, they're stopping at another camp. Taylor, out. <laughs> Taylor. Taylor, God. Damn it! Stupid kid's gonna get himself killed. Lieutenant Weaver, you there? I'm at the mine. Good, good. Okay, man. You take a look around. The report I saw listed ore testing kit. You're gonna need one. Ore testing kit. Copy that. The center bar is kind of red, but not shiny. Hmm. It'll have a dull luster to it. It's gonna be hard to miss. Test the ore. It's got to be at least 60% pure, or I can't use it. Alright, got it. Testing kit, testing kit. Where the hell am I going to find a board testing kit? Maybe one of these, uh, shit. Nothing in here. Say Red Rock, Dull Luster, Cinnabar. Yeah. All right, let's see how pure this is. All right.
Cinnabar, that's good. Good. Of them. Let's see if this pump is working. Jenny's out of gas. Jenny's always out of gas. See how pure this is. Elevator shaft. Oh, God damn it. Wonder where this goes. Only one way to find out. And what's up here? Another tunnel? Looks like this one was abandoned a long time ago. A narrow beacon? In here? Another Nero micro recorder. Uh, another Nero injector. Good. Steroids. Is that what this shit is? Lieutenant Weaver, this is St. John. I've got the Cinnabar you asked for. St. John, good, good. I'm almost ready for it. I'm, oh, hold on a sec. Can I help you, Lieutenant? Weaver, I ran out of isopropyl alcohol. Do you have any? Yeah, I got a bottle of vodka back in my tent. Stop by later. <laughs> Jesus, you never give up, do you? Don't be such a stranger. Fuck off. St. John. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, just drop off the hall as soon as you can. I got some more shit I need you to get. Weaver out. If you can. Huh. Oh, here we go. 
Good. Oh, roided out freaks. That's just great. Get St. John to Captain Corey. St. John to Corey, come back. St. John, I've just spoken with the Colonel. He's assigned you to the Research Division? Captain, uh, Research Division, or, uh, yeah, I guess you would call it that. Uh, I'm helping Lieutenant Weaver and Lieutenant Whitaker. Good. They can use all the help you can offer. I don't know how much help I'm gonna be, and just sort of their errand boy for now. And actually, that's why I radioed in. Lieutenant Whitaker gave me a requisition form that says yeast. Yeast? Hold a second. We have patrols making supply runs throughout the region. When they come across anything of potential value, they note it down. Yes. Here. The yeast and other baking supplies were noted in the kitchen area of the Crater Lake Visitor Center. You know where that is? We'll find it. Got sick. <laughs> you want to know the truth? Lieutenant. <laughs> nah, man. Leave that shit by the door. No, 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 no. I mean all that army shit. Oh. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I think that's what you were looking for. All right. Yeah. yeah this is great. Hey, just wait a second. Here. Polystyrene. Yeah, you know, like white foam coffee cups, packing peanuts, shit like that. Yeah, got it. Hey, man. By the way, how did it go with the Wizard Island Witch? You mean Lieutenant Whitaker? <sighs> man, I thought you were going to leave all that shit by the door. That'll be all, Corporal. That'll be all. You got something to say about it? That's the last of them. Okay. I'm gonna help. Stop doing that, please. I'm sorry? I know that things are strange, but I can't help that right now. Well, I live in a barracks with a dozen militia assholes. And my wife lives in a private tent up on an officer's ridge. Nothing strange about that. Deacon. And the only time that I see her is when I'm done running one of her errands. Nothing strange about that either, ma'am. I used to thank you. Uh, are, are you baking something? I mean, if you need an oven, I know no, where to find no, one. No, no, I'm using it to create <clears throat> viral proteins that they, they trigger these antibodies. <laughs> but of course, you are being sarcastic. Bread, viral proteins, it's all the same to me. 
Hey, wait a second. Here. Thank you. You already said that. I meant for stay. Yes, ma'am. Set them over there. Thank you. Corporal St. John, this is Dr. Jimenez. St. John? Hey, Doc. This is Deacon. What can I do for you? Oh, St. John, good. I need you to stop by the infirmary. Uh, is something wrong? You need something? No, no. Nothing like that. I want to check on that arm. My arm? My, my arm's fine, Doc. <laughs> a burn like that? From a wood stove? It's nothing to play around with. You want La Infección? You come see me. That's in order. All right, Doc. All right, fine. Whatever you say. St. John out. Hey, Doc. Uh, Come in. Siéntese. Have a seat. Have a seat. Mm -hmm. oh. Let's look here. So, who did you ride with back in the day? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're uh, getting at. No me mientas. Look, Corporal. I spent 20 years in East L.A. patching up bandas de motoristas and every other kind of pandillero. I know the look. And this? No kind of wood stove did this. All right. Keep it clean. It'll heal on its own. Leave a nasty scar. But I want you to come back and see me in a couple of days. You got it. Funny thing. When the city burned and the hordes came in, neighborhoods at war for decades all came together. Fought together. Latinos, güeros, chinos, bloods, crips. Didn't matter. Crazy what it takes to bring people together sometimes, no? Thanks, Doc. <laughs> 